All right. I just, I'm not even going to pull over. I'm just going to continue doing what I'm doing. Got a mask on because I'm about to go into a store. Otherwise, I usually wouldn't drive with this thing on, but it's literally like a minute away. So I'm just going to talk because I have the platform to be able to do so. So why not? This is about motivation. Now, anyone listening or watching this could tell me whatever they want to tell me about a whole bunch of different things. Like, you may be stronger than me, taller than me, better than me in a lot of things. But when it comes to this discipline thing, and when it comes to applying it, to a certain way of consuming calories, you can't tell me a damn thing. You can't tell me anything about that. Because my mind is at a certain level. And if you're not there, you need to catch up. So going back to motivation, This is how I look at it. You got a lot of excuses. You got a lot of excuses for a whole bunch of things when it comes to the way you eat, the way you consume. But let me tell you one thing. When it comes to showing up for your priorities... If you got to go to work, are you coming out with an excuse like, I'm not at that level to not show up to go to work? Or do you have bills or obligations that need that paycheck to come to you consistently? So you're going to do whatever it takes, right? So how is this any different? Where you're going to tell me that you're not on my level. Because all you really have to do is show up for yourself. And treat it the same way you would do your employer. Because your employer is not trying to hear, oh, you know what? I'm tired. I didn't feel like going to work and I didn't really feel like telling you. Your job is not going to put up. With you saying, you know what? I'm not at that level to be able to do the whole shift. I'm not really up to that place where I can. And you're going to tell me like, oh, these are, you know, apples and potatoes. Like totally different. No, it's not. Because it's your mind. And when it comes to motivation, it's a, it's not about me giving you motivation. Through this post right here. It's about you taking your goals seriously. And you taking yourself seriously. Especially if you have guidance. Because no one was guiding me. When I was trying to get to this level. But I found it. Now with guidance. If you're trying to give all the excuses in the world. But for certain things you have no excuses whatsoever. Because according to you. Because when you wanted to develop the goal in your head, like, I'm going to do this. And you come across someone like me who's telling you, well, this is what it takes. And you say, yeah, I'm going to do anything and everything it takes to accomplish my goal. You had that in your mind, right? You said you were going to make that happen for yourself. You created that goal. But you can't live up to your own word for yourself. But when you pick and and remember, in this case, I'm your mentor. I'm your counselor. I'm your drill sergeant. I'm your guru. You can even call me your employer if you want. But you don't treat me like I'm the boss. You don't treat me like... I'm someone who's trying to guide you. 
You treat me like dirt because you treat yourself like dirt. And you're not serious about your goals. But you're serious about that termination when that paycheck doesn't come to you. But you can't think of this the same way. I want you to think about that.